Welcome to our third episode of On the Road. I appreciate you joining me again as we talk about cashless tolling here at KTA. Today, we're gonna to run up to Topeka, we're gonna to check out our new administration building we're building. And on the way, we're gonna give a ride to our HR director, Diana Enzyme, as we talk a little bit about how it affects our workforce. Well, Diana, I appreciate you joining me today. Oh, thank you for the ride. So I, I may be going up to Topeka and I thought what a great opportunity as we look at our new administration building to talk a little bit about our workforce. So our workforce has really been changing over the years. We've got a lot of folks that have been retiring, right? Well, actually, Steve, we've had quite a few. In the last four years, we've had about 77 people retire from KTA. So of those retirees, a lot of those were toll collection, but we still have a few toll collectors left, right? Yes, we do. We're going to need our toll collection staff clear up to the day that we switch to cashless tolling. Absolutely. We have a workforce transition plan in place to help those collectors that are still with us that are not going to retire, right? Correct, we do. It allows them to either gain skills that can help them transition to another position at KTA or also learn skills that they may be able to use outside of KTA. So we've got an opportunity to either transfer you to a different job, retrain you for something different, or you're going to retire. So we've got a good plan for our workforce, don't we? We sure do. In the last 10 years, our customer service center has grown from five customer service reps to about 30 now, including a team that reviews license plate images. You know, those offices, along with all the back offices we have, those are all going to continue to grow. Well, Diana, you know, what we're doing here in Cash's Tolling is very similar in modernization efforts across all industries, banking, the grocery stores. It just feels like everything is becoming more automated and that's what we're trying to do, save money and shift those jobs to different ways of providing customer service. So, you know, you're headed to Topeka right now and we've got the new building there and there's going to be about 40 seats in our new call center there. Well, I'm going to go get a progress update today to find out when that building is going to be done because I'm really excited about getting people started and, and, and really continuing our cashless tolling plan. Well, Diana, we are pulling up to your spot and I really appreciate taking a little bit of your time today. Yes, I really enjoyed it and I appreciate the ride. Yeah, no problem. Rich. Good morning, Steve. Hey, good morning. How's it going, man? Great. We're here at this old facility. Been around a while. 1955. What do we have here? We've got engineers and... Primarily, it is our engineering staff. Our general counsel is currently sharing a space with us upstairs, but the space has obviously outlived its usefulness in terms of overall staffing. What I'm really excited about today is we're going to go get a little update on the new facility. It's just across the street pretty just much. Just across the street. Yeah, that's exciting. All right, let's go check it out. Yes, let's yes. do that. Oh, Rich, it's looking good, man. A lot looking, of stuff going on right now. Well, I can't wait to show you the progress. Can't wait to get inside and look at it. This facility really represents what we do. I, I see gantries, I see concrete, I, uh, we're going to see asphalt, we're going to see stone. I mean, is, isn't that, that's the theme, right, implemented in this exactly, building? Exactly, exactly. All the use of materials in this building is, is a real illustration of the turnpike itself. All right, Rich, it's really looking like something, so I can actually tell where rooms are going to go. So we're going to have a retail facility for KTAG. We have our engineers housed here. We'll have a new call center for all our call center reps. This is the call center. You'll have uh, 40 workstations in here, so your customer service staff will be housed in here. This is the engineering wing. We've just passed by what will be a controlled entry point into this area. We also have our uh, general counsel who will be housed down here with his own conference space and an, an additional legal office. Well, Steve, this is going to be our engineering open office. This is where several of our engineers will be worked and housed in here. 
Uh, we'll actually have a separate small conference space that's in here. We'll, we'll have monitor and display on the wall so that they can hold their team's meetings in here. Well, this is your main conference room. This is where your authority board will meet. It's probably where you have public meetings or, or presentations if that's something that you also need to or want to do. It's nice that we now can utilize something. We didn't have this size of room up here in the northern part of the Turnpike area, so I'm excited about that. Well, Rich, you, we've tried to think of everything, right? So yeah. what's this area we're standing in? Well, you'll have an enclosed patio area here, so this will be a nice separate area off of the break room for your employees to use. Okay, Rich, so in the scheme of completion, where do we currently sit with this building? Uh, Hutton tells us that in their estimation, we're about 70% complete. Uh, and they currently have a target date of occupying the building about mid-December. Yeah, I can hear them. They're working hard. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so mid-December, that's, uh, that's coming quick. Yeah, uh, seems like it's a little ways off, but it'll be here pretty fast. What a great opportunity we had today to get a little bit behind the scenes, checking out our new KTA administration building here in Topeka. This is going to be a great facility to help us in the future as we modernize, to help our customers, to help our staff, really help us with cash as towing. Hey, we're really excited about where we're going here at KTA. We'll see you on the road.